Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video tutorial, I will explain in React.js how to render components randomly on a browser refresh. And here we got the funnel output of our application. Notice the header tag. Display React.js components randomly when page loads. Now we got the React component 1 here. The component 1, when a page reloads, here we got the component 3, the third component. So this is component 2. Again we got the component 3. That's it. In this video tutorial, I have explained clearly how to display React guest components randomly when page loads. This is the component 1, this is component 2 and this is component 3. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. Before continuing this video tutorial, I sincerely recommend please watch my previous CAD.js tutorial series. You can find those video tutorials in my channel playlist. Now let's continue the today's tutorial. I am using Visual Studio 2019 to create a React.js application. For this video tutorial, I am using ASP.NET React. ASP.NET Core React.js and Redux application, open Solution Explorer, just for the time saving I have already created one React.js application and in this application notice the client app folder which contains all my front-end applications which means the client side applications like React.js components. In this client app folder there is a source folder, all my components I am adding in this components folder. Let me expand this components folder. Now let's create um, four components in this folder. New item. I'm selecting JavaScript file to create a component. This is one component. Let's create three more components. Add new item, JavaScript, two component. Let's add the third component, new item, third component and the fourth one which is the main component to display the components randomly on this component, main component. And here we got all the four components. So first let's create first component import react from react library after that i'm defining a class component called one component extends component uh, component in a class component there is a main method called render inside this render method i'm adding the return to display the output which is this is component one this is the output i want to display from this component which is one component the final step export default i'm adding one component my component name that's it now let's copy this one and adding to the second component just for the time saving instead of writing the same code two component two component and this is component two and this is a third component third component third component and this is third component now the main component contains the actual logic to display three these three components randomly so again i'm importing the render react react from react library then defining a class component main component extends a component and this component uh, contains a main method render return method 
let's add the default export default export default main component now here the logic so first we require one constructor whenever we add constructor we need to add the super method once we add the super method this dot state is equals to curly brackets I'm defining an array component array uh, in this array I'm adding let's add the square brackets here uh, we need to import our components first one component from the path of the component one component again I'm adding the second component from two component import third component from third component now let's add these components here which are my component names comma two component third component let's go with the column now I want to render these three components randomly for that I'm using the math.float method which is a JavaScript function uh, here we require one event component uh, component display let's add this is an event this event return I want to return e math dot flow method of flow method contains a math dot randomly into the length of the array so a dot length property after that I want to display the output in the written method let's add the center center tag Let's add the h1 header tag. How to display component ReactJS component ReactJS component randomly when page loads. I'm adding horizontal line. After that, I want to display the output which are the components so first we need to add our event event something went wrong here the misses on for here the constructor I have to close okay now after adding this event the event e we are getting from this array so this dot state dot my array name which is a component array that's it we have done the complete coding part in this component now the final step we need to configure our component in the index.tsx file open solution explorer index.tsx file I'm adding my component name let's include this component in the header section that's it let's save this file we'll check the final output and here we got the final output of our application notice the header tag display react just components randomly when page does now we got the react component one here the component one when a page reloads here we got the component three the third component 
So this is component two. Again, we got the component three. That's it in this video tutorial. I have explained clearly how to display React guest components randomly when page loads. This is a component one, this is component two, and this is component three. And I'm calling these three components in this main component. That's it. Thanks for watching and please subscribe my channel.